Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2 Episode 5. This is the last episode of the Hidden, hidden Inventory arc. And then next episode we have, or like we got a free week break. And I guess we go back to the present during episode 6. I can't wait though. Great, amazing stuff this arc. Last episode was phenomenal. Gojo transcended. Toji sadly perished. As always, down below Patreon if you want a full and cut reaction. With that said, let's get into the full episode. You know, the last episode of this JK, the Hidden Inventory arc. I can't wait. And the animation look kind of freaky right now, bro. Automatic, okay, so we just does it like that. Okay, interesting. Damn, that's crazy. So we just don't be like that off the bat. Shoko, you're looking so creepy in both these shots, bro. Do my girl dirty. Oh, wow. Oh, damn, the hand animation kind of clean with it. Okay, I like that. I like that. Get, yeah, get all looks like broken inside. Yeah. Hmm, because you have to do it all alone or what? Damn, what, what, what's going on Ghetto? Is he going for like some depression or something? You know? Because, well, I obviously think something happens to Ghetto this episode for him to sort of change, you know? Who am I doing this for exactly? Damn, he really don't have a goal in life, almost, you know? So what happens, bro? That's what I'm confused about, yeah? He keeps thinking about the... Damn, that boy really going for it. Like, damn, that boy Ghetto going through it for it. Crazy with it. Those claps are like echoing in his mind though. For whatever reason. I haven't seen this hybrid guy in the future. I wonder if he this is about to off him, you know? Which would be insane. Oh, Ghetto has his hair like, uh, hmm. Damn, why is it kind of a, you know? It's kind of, kind of scaring me right now, Ghetto. Ooh, okay, is this the... I don't know who this person is, but it must be some relation to Toto. All the character fucking models look so scary this episode some shots, you know? Damn. Okay, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 damn. Yeah, don't like that, it's crazy. Casual treatment, huh? What is that? Like I said, the character models are freaking me out this episode. They all look very uh, interesting. Uh-huh. Oh damn, I like the thing he's doing in the back of it. That's really cool. That's really cool. Who's five senses, huh? Wow. That's what I'm saying. Told you this is a different level. And Maki has the uh, same, right? Yeah. She's interesting the hell out of me. I feel like I've seen her before, but I don't know if I've maybe seen like a panel of her or something. Who knows? And then... Damn, yeah. Hmm. Oh, did he take that literally, though? How about... Yeah, no, that that is not a meaning. You know, if he says we have meaning to it, that's not the meaning we're looking for. <sighs> mm. Like, meeting this woman was definitely not the good thing to do. I said it's becoming like a, a thing for him. Mm. But the claps into the rain is crazy. One of them is your true thought. Damn. You're only giving them those two options, though, huh? Who? 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 Yeah, okay, so we're gonna find this out later, and I feel like it might be a big draw, but let's wait and see who it is, you know? Is this Nanami? I heard a voice. What's going on here? Nanami? What's going on with you, bro? Oh, okay. I'm guessing Fingy died. Yeah, 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 that, yeah, thought so. Damn, that's tough. Jesus Christ, he got fucked up. That is a wild ass shot. Jesus, bro. This episode is so, like, has such an aesthetic to it, and, like, it's almost eerie in a sense, right? Damn, get a look like a lookism character. If you know, you know. Wait, aren't these the two girls from the movie? Now that I think about it? But when I remember those two girls, right? Hmm. This is creepy as hell, bro. Ghetto, I don't know what's going on with you. Ghetto, you are... Yeah, that boy lost it. That boy has lost it completely. I feel like meeting that woman might have been the worst thing for him. Low-key. I'm not actually too sure. Oh, wow. So this is a report on Ghetto? Since the death. Wow. Damn. Probably Gojo can't believe this. Yeah. 
Damn, man, you know Brent's can't believe it, bro. Hmm. Yeah, Gojo can't believe it, yeah. And the shots are getting hit. So, just wild shots, you know? Like, I think it's- This episode is doing something to make me feel uncomfortable. Whether it be the character shots, the camera shot, you know, the character designs, all that. It's doing something. Damn, Shoko so smiles at him. Damn. Damn. Shoko does not care. She gonna text Gojo and Gojo is just gonna come in instantly. Damn. I love my girl Shoko, bro. She just vibing, you feel me? And we saw, I'm pretty sure we saw the shot from the movie where they're both in the street. That's what we're getting here, right? Damn. Got a point. You go to a pleading, bro, but I don't get it. Yeah, Ghetto is just like a different man, you know? Mmm. Mmm, that's a question, you know? If I, this is, if I could become you. Ah, that's what it meant. You just let him go? go? Or like what? You can, you can, you yeah, didn't have it in you to use you. Yeah. Damn. He did not have it in him. That is crazy. That's sad, bro. That's really sad. I feel like crying, you know? That's sad, man. That why I became a teacher and everything like that. Did he actually. Did he go to this dude? Wow. That's crazy. I said that those were the two girls in a movie and I fought, right? I'm pretty sure they were. I'm pretty sure. I don't, I don't know. I remember those two. Uh, they look familiar. And they're going to clap. We're going to end the uh, end awkward clapping. Jesus Christ. Damn. Yeah, you, you said I don't care. This episode looks insane. Like the way they've done it, it's been wild. Stinking monk. Yeah, wow. That That's crazy. That's wild with it. Ah, Gojo and Megami, yeah? Oh, damn. Mm. Gojo, what are you doing? I'm gonna go like that, you know? Wow, okay, you're actually gonna go tell him. Mm. Interesting. Smart ass kid, for real. Damn, he does everything. Oh, oh. Damn, and he went serious there, huh? And he's doing some something for someone else, and I guess that's kind of Gojo's way of saving himself. Yuji? Yeah, Yuji! Yuji! Oh, damn! Oh my god, bro, it's been so long! It's been so, so long, bro. It's been so long, bro. God damn. Postcard, that's a good thing. Wild. Okay. Honestly, can't wait. We're finally back in the present. What a phenomenal arc. Ghetto was going through it. And the way they did the episode was like such a aesthetic way where it made you feel uncomfortable. In the character movement, the character designs. I noticed from Shoko in the first shot. I was like, yo, this dude them a bit too much. I felt uncomfortable. And that's what we're doing. You know the way Ghetto was moving and shit? I felt uncomfortable. And whoever the director was for that episode, phenomenal job, honestly. Damn, down below if you want a full-on cut reaction. Let me know what y'all think um, about the episode, about this whole arc. Really happy to see, you know, the gang, uh, Nobara, Megumi, Yuji, uh, and Gojo, you know, all together in that room. Uh, looks phenomenal. Really can't wait. Let me know what y'all think down below. Like and sub. I'll see you next time. Sensei, out.